training in general, we, we try to do some type of training every day on duty. Constantly right. training. Yes. You never you never stop learning in this in this this field. You know, every day is a learning experience. As you can see from the beginning, when it started, uh, car fires can get very intense. So, car does happen to catch on fire. You know, number one, number one priority is your safety. You know, get away from the car. Get get everyone out of the car. And just, just get away from it. Uh, preferably stand at a 45 degree angle from it, or off to one of the sides. have a lot of things that could go wrong on, on vehicles like this during a fire. You have shocks. Uh, some of them have the, the uh, bumpers, the older cars have the bumper shocks that could pop out and hit you in the leg or anything. Um, so you want to want to be very careful of that. Uh, a lot of them have airbags now um, that can deploy. As uh, Firefighter Monroe was talking about the, uh, the gas powered shocks and bumpers as well as the, uh, the struts to hold the hood up and the, the rear hatchback, uh, this explode and become missiles. It's all the intent of the vehicle want to get, get as far away as possible. Yeah, oh yeah. Um, you know, with the extreme heat, um, the gases that the fire produce, you just don't want to breathe into that. Just get as far away as possible. <laughs> 